All right, a quick little demonstration showing that when the temperature of a ball goes down, its pressure goes down. And we're going to use a basketball, because basketballs are really nice. You don't need a, a pressure gauge in order to measure the pressure of a basketball because the pressure determines how high it will bounce. So if the pressure is high, the ball will bounce high. If the pressure is low, it will bounce much lower. Now, this is a, a room temperature ball. Now, Sophia, if you can come down, oh, sorry, and run to the refrigerator where we have an identical ball that we put in the fridge for a couple of hours. The only difference is that this ball's temperature is much lower than the room temperature one. Here's the little demonstration. So hold that in your right hand nice and steady. Hold this one over here and count of three. Drop them together. One, same height, two, three. And you see that the room temperature ball bounced much higher than this cold one over here. And that shows that the pressure in the cold one has gone down. You can see this more dramatically from a higher release of the two balls. So in the count of three, there you go. The room temperature ball bounced much higher again than the cold one, showing that the pressure of the cold one has gone down. All right, that's all from the Day Green Science Lab Science at Home. Yo! Yo, all right, see ya.